everyone, Neon Jigglypuff here. Welcome back to another episode of Paper Mario Thousand Year Door. In the last episode, we came to the giant island in the sky called Glitzville of glitz and glory where there's magical fights, RPG style, and hot doggies. I love hot doggies. I prefer hamburgers. How's it going, guys? Neon Jigglypuff here. Welcome to... I already said it that. Oh, I'm so excited. This is my favorite. I did not mean to squeeze your bob. Uh, this is my favorite episode. Yeah, my favorite chapter. Chapter three. I know where every shine sprite and every single star piece in the in this chapter is. I know everything about this chapter. You want to know why? I'm going to get some white now. I said white. Look at that. Star piece right there. I'm going to get that. And there's also a star piece somewhere around here. I don't know if I got it last time, but uh, I know there's one somewhere around here. Ground pound here. And I was right. Uh, grab on it. Wait, uh, uh, Mario, get get this. Yes, star piece. I know where every. I love this chapter so much. I'm so excited. Ah there's also another star piece here. I know where it is. I'm gonna get them all right now. Ah, you, could, you hit this block right here with the hammer, then you get a shine spot right there. And uh, look at that rock over there. That flurry girl. Look at that rock. It looks like um. Either a nose or a rocket, and nothing else. Oh, the Traveling Sisters 3! I'm so excited! In card or coupon. There's also another. Wait, it's going. Wait, should we go in here? Nah, you know, I'll stay this place for a little bit, but I know there's something in there, don't worry. Uh, let's save that for a little bit later, too. There's some stuff that I want to, you know, save for a little bit. Hmm, you know what? Screw it. Actually, no, 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 no. Screw it. We're going in here. Fresh, fresh juice. If you go over here, ooh, star piece, and who is this girl? Ooh, ooh, you, you cute. That fabulous mustache, I've seen it somewhere before, I know it. Yes, Mario, that's definitely a name I've seen somewhere before. That's, a, that's all you have to say, girl. You know, uh, who needs Peach, you know? I got a flurry. I got this girl. I have Miss No Arms. I don't need Peach anymore. She's old anyway. Okay, no, never mind. Okay, let's actually go on with the chapter. I'm just so excited. To hey, Ushi! Ushi! See the hot dog over there? Best hot dog menu of all time. No joke. Hey, but you're gonna look more at fighting than hot dogs. Are you a pro? I'll root for you. Oh my God! There's a hot dog. And guys, look. You can be a hot dog. Look at this. Flurry, can you be a hot dog? Girl? Girl? Um, your, your your boobs can be a hot dog. How about Coops? I know you're tall enough, right, Coops? Come on, Coops. Do it. Coops haven't been... Ah, Coops! How about... There's no arms. No, there's no arms! Can you be a, a hot dog? Probably not. You're too short. You don't have any arms. Um, okay. Miss No Arms. You know what? Miss No Arms hasn't been out for a while. Should I keep her out? I kind of want to. Uh, you know what? No, I kind of want Fleur. You know, I, I gotta get my girl out. Girl. Whoa, Mario. Whoa! His hand is not... Welcome to your customer. The aroma of yum in the air, especially in the glitz pill. Mr. Huggles, from his hot doggies. Only 10 coins for one. You will buy one? $10. For a hot dog. Okay. No. I'm not doing it. But... I did find a bunch of stuff, so I'm gonna save. I believe there's one more star piece somewhere in the thing. It's only, it's been like four minutes, I haven't even like, it's like three, four minutes, I haven't done anything yet. I believe there's a star piece somewhere out here. I know it's behind one of these pillars, isn't there? I think there is. I think. There's gotta be something here. I know there is. I remember something being here. No, really? Okay, I get, wait a minute, ground pep. Oh! I guess that's the one I was looking for. Okay, let's go inside now. This is my favorite chapter. I'm so happy. Ah, I've been recording for a while, too. I'm pretty glad to be back. I keep saying this. I'm glad to be back. I never went anywhere. I have... <gasps> well, hello, Mr. Mustache. We meet again. Is that all you have to say? Miss Matt, girl. I mean, you're a, you're a mouse. I don't want you. I got, I got flurry. I got flurry. Oh, Mario. Oh, my God. It's a baby Uji. Mr. Mustache Guy, where's Prince Mush? I don't know who that is. Sorry, good. 
Sorry, bub, but authorized people will only pass this point. Wait, what? Oh, I can't go there? Where am I supposed to go? I know where. You want to see something crazy, guys? Look at this. There's two entrances to the thing. Let's go inside here, the top one. The top one. Emphasis on top. And now I'm on the bottom. See those stairs? I, I want the top address. Oh, dear me! What a positively glorious venue! Oh, mercy me, Mario! Look there! Those two brutes are about to have that at each other! Oh, lordy! That's right! Ugh, I think about it all the time for you! Feel the wrong, brother! Oof! Oof! The Dez? Stay down, Pincushion! You don't want more of this! Why, why'd you even show up? Yeah, you hear me talking, Wimpy? Stay out of the ring! Or feel the burn, baby! Oh, brother! Tell you what! Do about a million push-ups and then come back to your Uncle Rockhawk! Rockhawk? Rockhawk. I... Guys, his name is Rockhawk. Rockhawk. Rock Rockhawk! I... I'm not even saying it, and it sounds like it. Oh my god. This is Rocky! Rocky, shout out to you. Rockhawk. Rockhawk. Rock. rock, rock I, I can't. This is PG. I'll give you another world-class spanking and send you crying home to mama again! Woo-wee, champ! That was a great A whooping! Your thoughts on the match? You call that a match? Ain't a fighter out there who can challenge me? No, no one can. Hear me? Ain't a fighter out there that can even make me sweat, brother! They're all a bunch of little crybabies running around in stinky diapers, brother! Got a bone to pick? Come fight me! Bring it! I'll take on anyone! You weaklings might as well stick to view game fighting, okay? Because I'll hurt you! Way to break the fourth wall. Yeah, number one, baby! Rockhawks is a champ! <laughs> oh! Oh my word, Mario! On that uncouth bird's belt! Is that, is that a crystal star? Oh lord, move over, sister! Yes, I do believe it is! That wonderful sparkle, yet, get another crystal star! Didn't we just get that one? It's a tawdry place to find it! Why would it be here of all places? Oh lordy! Didn't we just get that one? No, we didn't. No, we didn't. No, 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 we didn't. No, we didn't. Oh, whatever shall we do? I don't fancy the idea of stealing that fellow's belt. W what shall we do, Mario? Steal that thing. Battle our way to the top. Ah, uh, let's battle our way to the top. Oh, you darling man! I'm so happy to hear you say that. I'd expect nothing less. You're ten times the man of anyone here. You'll be the champion in no time, heart. Let's move on then, shall we? Our next step is to become the official fighters, I imagine. Oh, my heart is positively thumping. Let's get whoever is in charge this minute. That's not the only thing that's thumped. Never mind. Okay. Flurry? I didn't know Flurry was such a, like, a fighter. Girl? What's that, bub? You want to become a fighter? Hmm. Well, if, if you're serious, you better come meet Mr. Grubber, the promoter. Mr. Grubber's office is just on that hallway. You can't miss it. Head on through. You're just gonna let me through? I, I could be like lying. It's like I don't want to be a fighter. I wanna I, I wanna I wanna like you know beat somebody up like, <clears throat> or blow. <laughs> All right. Mr. Grubba's office is right down the hallway. Which way is it? I don't. I forgot. Wait, it's this one, isn't it? It's this one. Whoever moves out of the way is the one. I think this one is carpeted. Oh, that's the champion's room. Never mind. Um. Oh, this is awkward. I forgot where Mr. Grubb is. Off. This is it. This is it. What is that? Oh, this is right. Oh, it's right inside. Okay. Want to be a fighter? Go inside. Meet Mr. Grubber. Who in tarnation are you, son? And who let you in? This is Grubber's office. Yep, that's me, Grubber. And you're one rude dude coming in without a knocking. What now? An athlete, huh? You want to be a fighter? Ooh wee! That do change a thing or two, son! I always got time for up and coming! Yep, this place is packed to the grills with young fighters all primed and raring to go! I gotta say, son, you're a bit skinny for my taste, but I'm willing to give you a shot! Mario's skinny? Flurry is skinny? What are you talking about? Flurry's bigger than Grubba! 
Now play me straight, son. You want a live, glamorous life of a champ, don't you? Don Skippy. All right, all right, son. I hear where you're coming from, loud and clear, Ski. He is. If you guys don't know what species uh, Grubba is, Mr. Grubba is the same species as the best character in Mario Party 10, Spike. He is the same species as Spike. I... He's, he's a Spike. You can't go wrong with that guy. When I was just a poor pup, I didn't give a pokey's patoot of up for our fancy big city ways. But then I jumped into the world of martial arts and fought my way through fame and riches. And know what I realized? Being rich and famous is diggity dang dynamite! Now I can't mix it up in the ring no more, but I earned enough to set me for life. You reading me, son? Dreams do come true. Even if they ain't yours exactly. Yep, that's the key, son. Dream big and you'll get big. That's the winner's way. And when you make it big, you'll look back at all those small dreamers and laugh. You reading me over here, son? Oh, uh, uh, mm, uh, yeah. That's the spirit, Chief. Come on, let's have a little walk and talk. Come on now. Everyone keeps clipping through flurries. I mean, she's a wind spirit. Flurry didn't talk at all. It's just been Grubba and Mario just talking. Flurry didn't do anything. Um. Oh, it's giving me a tour. It's giving me a tour of the of the place. This isn't. Well, this is a nice room. That bed looks like it's made of wood, but it's pretty cool. With those presents. This is a pretty cool place. Now, how do you like this part? Just feast your eyes on this. This is the champion's room. Isn't it a sight? Deluxe, you become champion, you'll get the key to this room. And that ain't all, of course, that's the top of the big money and screaming fans. Yeah, no doubt about it, son. Apply yourself in a life of wealth and comfort awaits. Now, uh, this is the Major League locker room. A lot of contenders here. What you think, son? Not exactly glamorous, but it's clean and comfortable. Totally sanitary, too. Maybe I'm old-fashioned, but I care about my fighters, don't it? I'm trying to make him sound like King DDD and Kirby right back at you. Now, I'm sure you know this, son, but there ain't but one world champion. Clawing your way to the top and taking the belt to become the champ ain't easy thing. Ain't gonna be an easy thing. But that's the point, son. It wouldn't be worth it if there weren't no challenge. I can see you got the fire for it, too, pod. You got the Ava Tiger there. You're gonna be a champ, I think. I just feel it. I ain't never been so sure about a fighter. Oh, hey, one other thing. You gotta sign an itty bitty contract to be a fighter. It ain't no thing. Just take a second or two of your time and just jot your name right here, right? Sign me up. You sign the contract. Best thing you've ever done, son. Now you're Mario? Ain't a bad handle. Still, I gotta say, Pod, it lacks a little punch as a fighter's name. Get me? Let me see here. Bam! Ooh-wee! I got it! From now on, you're gonna be the Great Gonzalez! Who? Ain't that a beaut? Dang, ain't that a stroke of genius? A name that good only comes once in a lifetime! Yep, everyone will soon bow before the Great Gonzalez! Make me proud, son! Well, that'll be got the business side out of the way. Jolene! Could you come in here a minute, darling? Ooh. Yes, sir. You wish to see me? I don't. I don't, I don't know. I don't know what voice to give her. Sure, indeed, hon. Jolie, this is the great. I just kicked my fan in the middle of a cutscene. Sure, indeed, hon. Jolene, this is the great Gonzalez, our newest rising star. Be a peach and take him on to the minor league locker room, alrighty? Right away, sir. Mr. Gonzalez, would you please be so kind to follow me? Okay, Flurry didn't talk at all. Flurry's just kind of staring at Grubba. Grubba's staring back. Ooh. As you know, you are a contracted fighter now, so you must abide by some rules. First and foremost, Mr. Grubba says, goes, period. You must do what he says. Also, as per your contract, you cannot quit until Mr. Grubba releases you. 
there are many other small guidelines that I will explain when they become relevant. What is this trash? They didn't show us this. We, we got that. Okay, they did not show us this when we signed the contract. Well, here we are. This is your locker room. This is garbage. You're starting in the minor league, of course, as you've just started your career. If you don't like this singy room, I suggest you work your way up through the rank. What is your command? Preserve a match. Well, howdy, Gonzalez! Ready to get your fist dirty, huh? There you go, son! I got a treat for you! Your first battle's gonna be with the Goomba Bros! Don't worry about them. They'll be a piece of cake. Just mop them up, will you, son? Or okay, son? You want to get everyone fired up through the appeal crowd at least once. So, yeah, we have special guidelines with every, with every battle. So, yeah, we have a guideline for every battle. He's going to ask us to do at least one thing. Like, don't use your partner. Appeal once. Use no items. Only jump. Don't use your hammer. Or don't jump at all. You know, we have guidelines. And it's... It's, it's a different every battle, so it's very important to read what he says, because if, if you don't do the guidelines and you win the battle, you will not rank up. You'll just stay exactly where you are. But if you lose a battle, you'll, you'll rank down. So, yeah, it's best to just pay attention to what Grubba says, and you'll be fine. Yep, I understand all that. Yep. I, skip, I, like, I know I skipped all that, but I'm sorry. I should probably sleep before... Oh, he's here already. Gonzalo, smash time, bub. Follow me. Okay, security's here to d escort you. I know, security's here to escort me, but I want to... I can't nap, can I? I cannot nap. Well... <laughs> oh my god! What the hell just happened? Alright, let's go. Let's go battle. First battle of the chapter. I love this chapter so much. People say they don't like this one. But I don't know why. Like, sure, it, it's grinding. You get a lot of experience points from this. You level up, like, I think in this chapter, on average, you level up, like, maybe three times. I think. And the newcomers here hankering for a hammer and meet the Grey Gonzalez. The Goomba Bros have been waiting. Now. I'll head up for the fight. Let's check in. Here's our first battle with the Goomba Bros. There's five Goombas here. How do, Goomba Bros? How are y'all feeling today? You ready for this fight? Ugh, oh, you kidding, man? We're always ready to bonk a fool or two. Who is this Gonzalez rookie? A cocky idiot, that's who. Winning just makes us mad. You're gonna teach us tardy punk. We're gonna teach us tardy punk respect fighters with with sonority. And maybe you ought to call an ambulance for him now, just to save time later. Here we are. How did it dang? Five fans, there's a great Gonzalez here, striding up on. Or in, I, I guess. <laughs> I tell you... Wait, what? Is that... Grubba or the Goomba? I tell you, this rookie's got some guts strolling up late. If I, like he owns the place, woohoo, I don't... Oh, that was Grubba, I think. Uh, okay, Gonzalez, listen up. Let me just explain th the rules of this match real quick. Have a bonk, punk! He couldn't wait, he... Oh! What sort of base coward attacks before the match officially begins, honestly? Come on, Mario, darling. We shan't lose to these low lives. Let's teach them a lesson. Ah, uh, quit crying, will you? Just a little welcome gift for the rookie. Now, where's our thank you? You bastards. You know what? I'm gonna one-shot all of these guys. Right now. You know what time it is? It's time for a multi-bounce. Goodbye. One shot. That's what you get for ruining one experience point. That's what you get. That is what you get, Goombers. Ugh. Oh, look at Flora, she's happy. The great Gonzalez wins. Hey, tell me, son. What was the first taste of victory like? That battle savage. It was okay, alright. That fight? What a joke! I'll tell you what I just saw, folks. A whooping! This kid's got skills! We got ourselves a new hero! Let's hear it for him, folks! Yeah, the great Gonzalez! Flurry's so happy. Look at her. She's proud. She's proud. She didn't even do anything. But she's proud of Mario. 
Oh my god, Flurry, honestly? Flurry? Boobs aside. <laughs> she's actually one of my favorite characters in this game. I love her personality. I love her, like, her passion. I just love Flurry. She's hilarious. I love Flurry so much. She's awesome. That fight wasn't a total loss. Listen, son. If I was gonna play to the clap. I forgot to appeal. I forgot to appeal. I was so caught up in the fight. I forgot to appeal. Um, you know what? Yo, Rook, how was the first fight, dog? I'm King K, man. Just a Bush League scrub like you. Good meeting you, man. You look a stand-up dude. I think I can hang with you. As long as you meet the gang, huh? This guy here is Master Crash. Nice to meet you, Bomb! Well, well, now we got to know each other. I will give you advice, Bomb! As Mr. Olin was saying, you better Bomb! Obey Grubba's additions. If you clear the conditions and you win, you get to fight higher ranked foes, Bomb! If you can't clear them, Bomb! You end up battling a lower ranked fighter, Bomb! You, you can't climb the bomb ranks if you find the bottom of the barrel. Bomb bomb! Yep. Yeah. My man's got, you know, some speech issues, but he's got good advice sometimes. Not just sometimes. Bomb! Advice is always useful. Bomb bomb! Right. Whatever, man. This lean machine over here is Bandy Andy. Heh. <laughs> nice to meet you. I'm not, I'm not here too often. If you see me around, say hi. Oh yeah, if you sleep in the bed over there, your HP and FP will fully recover. It's not like the cushy bed in the champ's room, though. It doesn't refill star power. Okay, cool. And the last guy with the sweet purple ki kicks is known as Cleftor. Duck! Cleftor no like make friends with mustache! Easy there, Cleft Dog. Dude ain't the friendliest guy, but you'll get used to him. Anyway, that's the core of the minor league crew, man. You need something? Ask us. So making us feel welcome. I like King K. He's making us feel loved and welcome. I feel at home right now. I like this guy. Oh yeah, I almost forgot. You and me eventually got to square off. So good luck, man. That... This guy's nice. I forgot to do the action commands, so um, I'm going to have to refight those Goombas. But don't worry, I'll do it off camera. I'm actually gonna end off the episode off, end off the episode off right here. Wow, I'm gonna end off the episode. Oh, excuse me, right here. And uh, yeah, because we've done a lot. It was like story stuff, a lot of dialogue. But now we're actually gonna get into the gameplay next episode. So, as usual, thank you guys so much for watching this episode of Paper Mario Thousand Year Door. And if you guys enjoyed, please do not forget, forget to leave a like, subscribe, favorite, and comment, and click that bell to be notified with every new video I make. Not just Paper Mario, but I make other stuff too every now and then, like Mario Shouts, Bayonetta, and Paper Mario Kiss. And, uh, yeah. So, question of the day. Uh, let's see. Put yourself in this situation. You're after a collectible. It could be anything. A important piece of jewelry. Anything that you, you absolutely need. And you have to fight your way to the top and, like, let's say... WWE, because that's kind of what this is. It's, it's pretty weird, and, you know, it's rigged. It's rigged. So, uh, yeah. What would you do? Or, like, any kind of fighting place. Would you do this? Would you fight way to the top, or would you try and steal the belt? Personally? If I'm going against champs? I'm not Mario. I'm going to try and steal that thing, maybe. Uh, if I have a partner, though, like Flurry or Koops or Goombella, I'd probably at least try to fight my way to the top, and if I... And if I fail, I'm going to steal that thing. Well, what about you guys? Fight or steal? That's the question for today. And with that all said, I hope you guys have a great day. And I'll see you in the next episode of Paper Mario Thousand Year Door. See you later, guys.